Hey guys, hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more of our Burgundian Conquest campaign here. U4. So we're just making sure that this coalition doesn't happen. Palatinate also needs to be at least above 30. This is a bummer just because it is taking a bit of time. Uh, but it is what it is. Wilhelm. Oh wait. Austria is no longer the emperor? What the heck? Really? I wonder why. Yeah, he just didn't have the votes. That is really weird, man. Timothy is a sinner. Tim, how do you plead? So we're also almost up to our uh, max limit on our, um, what's it called? Governing capacity here. So those guys are now, let's actually Go through the new year here. here we go. We're not through the new year. Uh, and then who else we got? England. We're going to attack them immediately. Aachen, Berg, Gelray, Trier. I don't really care about any of these people. Trier, maybe, but like, I don't know. You can lose some money. That's no big deal. I think we just push this piece through. Oh, and there's another Demper, and it's Austria again. Okay. That was weird. Um, yeah, I don't think it's going to happen. I think this is okay. Let's take all his money. Let's uh, pay off his debt. And then these guys also are a little pissy about things as well. So let's um let's do like one dev click somewhere. That'll keep them loyal. And then these guys we just need to improve relations with. When's our truce with you guys up? June. So let's get everybody in in position here. Let's also get our galley our navy together because I don't want to get snack wiped. Let's get another general as well. Oh, they're so Bad, man. So bad. Bad generals are just tilting, honestly. Above all else, they're just tilting. Okay. So, two months, we're going to attack England immediately. As soon as our uh, truce is up, we're going to attack him. So he doesn't join our coalition. Don't give him the time to do it. Portugal will join. Castile will not. Whatever, dude. So let's reconquest uh, this province here. Con. And uh, have you guys come on down. Eventually, we'll go down to there to Bordeaux. This might look really weird, but we are slowly piecing things together. So we're going to get this province here. So that'll link up these guys. And we're going to take all this. And I'll probably give him Alençon as well. Probably. People are joining our coalition. What's his heavies look like? He's got eight. Oof. Yikes. So we do need to be careful here. Um, it won't fire because Castile is not in enough debt where he wouldn't back me up, I assume. Let's get you guys over there. Where's my cannon at, huh? Get the value cannon up there. What the heck? And these guys are um, probably deserving of a little bit of spy network, but I think I need to improve with these guys instead. We're almost done annexing these guys, so we'll be good. Portugal doesn't seem to be too interested in marching men over. They actually don't have that many, so this is fine with me so far. Let's get these guys down here, make sure that we can at least back them up. Free money is good. Let's uh, actually build up a couple of these camps here. That will raise our force limit significantly. And we'll be able to build a big, beefy army. We can afford it. It's just a matter of being allowed to have it in the first place. So we'll take that tech here. That is actually probably going to get us ahead, yeah? 
Nine, nine, nine. No, everybody's on nine. Feels bad, man. Well, I hope that they don't take that fort because that's a woods fort. It'd be great to defend on it. We'll see. They're on 21. I'll take the admin points. Let's uh, go with offensive guys as well. It's going to be good for us. And uh, sadly, oh, hey, we in we uh, inherited. No, we didn't. Never mind. I got excited. So this is a bummer. We literally just took tech. Um, long live Timothy, the Duke. Timothy, you must valiantly lead us into battle. So let's do this here. Let's just piece these guys out ASAP because I don't want to deal with this. Oh, come on now. This is woods though. Yikes, there's a lot of them. I'm a little nervous that they're gonna gang up on these guys up here. Yeah, we're gonna have to catch these guys out big time. We got a three shock general to our one shock. Hmm. So let's do something like this. Oh, come on now. You guys are goofballs. And they took his fort as well. Hmm. Bummer. Seven heavies. There's nothing I can compete with. Got a looming disaster as well. Let's see here. How do we want to manage this? This is wood, so we don't want to be too dumb on this. Let's take this. Okay. Go. Go for the quick little ones. This is good. They have no general. They're gonna reinforce. And uh, I said to flee there, but they're gonna flee somewhere else instead. So they're gonna have a bunch of men standing right there. Okay. Who's dying, everybody? I've lost 10,000? Really? To what? Yeah, attrition is a big one. Right, one more month and we can finally do this one, so. Get those guys out of there. Just kidding, they're gonna reinforce. Okay, let's get our guys grouped up here. Hmm, yeah, we don't wanna be in neutral territory, we wanna be in friendly territory. Let's get these guys out of Calais then. Let's put out the heavies. See if we can at least sink a couple of their light sheet light ships transports. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Good. So they're just gonna reinforce a bunch. Let's see here. Would really like to get a uh, discipline guy, but it looks like we're gonna win that fight anyways. Quite handedly, actually. So that's really good. Discipline is going to win us more battles. Got you guys split out here. So has he lost any ships yet? So let's fuck our heavies out. Oh, yeah, we just ran into his heavy fleet, didn't we? No, but they're lights. Yikes. Alright, well, that wasn't too surprising. Oh, I didn't even see Provence had all this over here. Let's uh, turn that one off for now. I just want to piece Provence out. I don't really care about... Um, where's he at? Right here. Actually, if I take this Nante or however this is pronounced... Nice, integration is a slow process. Let's core up some... State up some stuff as well. That'll probably give us a few more reasons to actually get some stuff from him.
Very good. How's my fort zones? Eh, not too, not really good, honestly. It's pretty bad. This is fine. Let's catch this little cannon here. Kill him. We're just gonna try to catch these guys here. They're uh, literally so fast. Let's boost stability there. Come on now. Okay. Once we peace out Portugal, it's just gonna be a waiting game on, you know, how soon does how soon can we get them out of the war? Yeah, let's do it. If they want to reinforce, they can. I'm definitely going to have superior numbers. So let's do this one. That should be good. That is a incredibly beefy fleet. Oh my gosh. Like, there's nothing I can do about that one. Head hunting. They're going for it. So he's going to give back that province and then those two provinces, eight expand AE and then this one will also go to Normandy. So something like that because it is Norman culture. Yeah. Oh, it's Frankian. Hmm. Maybe not then. And it's definitely not worth 11 AE either. We'll hold off. We'll see how things go. So it looks like these guys are getting beat up on. I love to see that. So Portugal's on medium enthusiasm now. I wonder why. Have they lost any men? Oh, they lost 17,000 men, apparently. Somewhere along the line. We have a new heir, Joseph, who is in 0 zero five three. All right, your name shall be Palmer. Another top supporter on the Patreon. Thank you, Palmer. Appreciate you. So they're heading out into their boats. So they're going to go land in this one here. So let's see if we can take them, give them, there you go. That's what I thought, idiot. And they got 23 men in Cala, Aaron, calling up here. And they're landing more. Goodness gracious. All right, cool. Let's let them siege that down. This is annoying. And their siege ability is really good. I don't know how. So this is farmland. This is all farmlands. Man. Are they going to win it? Oh, they pulled their cannons off, which is really good. Let's reinforce. While they're reinforcing, morale should jump up. There we go. We win that for sure. Good. And now we stack wipe all of them. So the Portuguese got stack wiped. That's worth it. That's definitely worth it. Ah. All right. Yeah, you know, it's like you think you're doing something smart and then the AI turns on and says, actually, I'm way better at than you and I'm just going to arbitrarily stack wipe your entire navy of three heavies as well. Damn, dude. All right, well, let's get those guys back. Go get those guys out of there. Manpower is still good. As we reinforce, these guys will become more and more um, obedient. So we don't have our royal marriage with those guys anymore, which is good. Austria's at war for uh, an offensive war, huh? Interesting. Not sure what that one's about. This one is for legitimacy of at least 90. Um, blasphemy Act sounds good. Oh, give me a break, man. So we're actually getting really close to this truce if we wanted it. Uh, we can probably peace out Portugal right now. 
Though I'm tempted to just let them siege him down so I can get more money. Because we're going to need some money after this one. We're, gonna run, we're probably going to end up taking a, taking a loan out or two out. So this is definitely a win for us. Don't know where you're going. Savoy has left our coalition because he sees us beating the crap out of England immediately after beating the crap out of France. And they know. They know. So, Portugal, still zero, or still eight, I mean. So how's the Reformation looking? Uh, that's a bummer that Poland got one, so we're probably going to see a Protestant Poland. Interesting. And these guys are up here, so let's get you guys up there, get you guys up here. I love losing stability, man. Anyway, stability. Oh, random stab events just drive me insane. And my air. Well, he's kind of bad, man. He's kind of bad. He's even worse. This guy is actually worse. A joke. A joke, that is. Get these guys out of here. Go, they stack up themselves. How many men have the English lost? 45,000 to my 47. So, pretty heavy losses on both sides, honestly. Portugal can be pieced out now, and they will give me their money, and you'll definitely, 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 definitely break that alliance. He's now on high enthusiasm. Reasons. There he's now he's on low enthusiasm. I will definitely take that army tradition. Uh just gonna have to wait it out. Let his uh war exhaustion tick up just a tiny bit. And eventually he'll give me this what I'm looking for in this war. Alright, Palmer. A little bit better, not that much better, but you'll do. We got Glogo again as the uh, Emperor. Really strange. go. Trade efficiency sounds good. Keep forgetting to take our crown land as well. There we go. Give me some money as well. I might as well just wait a couple of months and get the money. Push for a call for peace. Really? How do, how do you get down there, man? All right, whatever. This will do. Now everybody has their cores back. So, and England has this one little province here that France will probably take. France is at war with... I wonder how that works. He was just in that war defending him, so I don't really know what that's all about. But our lands are at least somewhat touched up. We just need one province over here. I think what we're going to do is we're going to attack for, like... Yeah, this Armagna. I'm going to attack for his claims. And we're going to release a um, Gascony, I think. But we need to start annexing another one then. How far off are we? So we could do this one as soon as we get our relations up with him. So we will. Who is disloyal now? Orléans again? Because I still haven't... Improved relations with him, apparently. We have a truce with him for a while. 18. Oh, yeah. So we're good. Let's have you guys... Um, find a place to uh, not take attrition so we can drill you. Dutch nobility demands estates. Brabant will gain all provinces... Held by our Dutch, Frisian, and Flemish subjects. And Brabant changes to the Netherlands. They stay in my PU. They stay a personal union. Okay. So that's actually really good then. 
So we can actually start integrating him as well pretty soon here. That's really good. Yeah, it frees up two slots there. Okay, I can live with that. I can definitely live with that. I didn't know that was a thing. That's a new one. That's definitely fresh to me. Uh, so as far as our force limit, how did it, how was it affected? We're up to 49, baby. And we haven't even finished our mill idea. He already joins the Republic. People are joining my, uh, my personal union. I really hope that I'm not like making some stupid mistake. Let's spend these points here and then take the prestige. And then let's also revoke crown land. Definitely want to make sure we're getting more crown land. People are joining our, leaving our coalition rather. So these guys have a couple of claims on Castile, but that's, he's my ally and I kind of need him. Ay ay ay. Royal Mary Austria as well. Oh, we need to annex this guy soon as well. But before then, let's uh let's go for his claims here. Uh, we're gonna go for like limousine and uh, what happened to you, Savoy? We're gonna go for limousine and he just attacked me. Oh, come on now, boys, really. And we're on Paris already. Oh yeah, he actually still has a pretty decent sized army. Let's uh, very good. He's got a 24 stack over there chilling, man. So let's um, let's not play this too dumb. Be there on the 31st. I could be there way before that. Do I want to? Might as well, it's woods, right? Oh yeah. Wow, he took super heavy losses there. What in the world was that? We might as well be able to, we might be able to track him down. There we go. No, this is a... Savoyard stack. Ah. Going for the chase here. Diplomatic points or mercantilism. I'll take the Diplo. That was pretty good, though. Definitely didn't see that one coming. <laughs> Turns out our army quality is actually pretty good compared to them. So let's take a look here. Uh, army quality. Our morale is better. Our discipline's better. We have a lot of professionalism, which is causing us to do a, deal a lot more casualties in the war, which is really good for us. So I need to make sure that we occupy all of this. This is essential. And we'll just peace Liege and Savoy out. Um, East Phrygia is being sieged down right now. The Dutch have a lot of ships. Really good for us. Okay. Let us uh, scootage these guys as well. Because we're going to annex them. And let's get back to improving with you guys. Might as well get their loot tick there. Okay. Yo, the Dutch have a giant army. 29? What are you talking about, dude? I'm really curious. I guarantee there's a, some stupid event that's going to be like, oh, the Dutch want to break free now. Going to tilt me, man. Going to tilt me. Don't tell me it's going to happen, chat. I'm going to be so sad if it does. All right, let's kill these guys. The sooner we can wipe out the Savoyards, the sooner we'll be able to piece them out. We can probably piece them out right now, actually. Oh, yeah. Very good. These guys are almost occupied, 28%. Father, they will be done. Or admin points. I'll definitely take the admin points. I think I'm actually just going to push economic ideas. See if we can push it through. 
Truce with Provence is over. Very good. And so we're going to actually be able to take everything we wanted in this war. So we just want these three. And release Gascony. So Trier, Saluzzo, Palatinate, all the same people as before, man. Let's um, let's get these guys topped off. And I think it's actually, okay, we have our improved relations guy already. So that's good. Two, four taxes, right? So let's turn those off. What am I doing? Turn it off, there we go. And we'll be able to piece out Liege. Does he have claims on it? He does not. But he is actually occup he's sieging him down, so I should probably get over there, yeah? 28% chance. They didn't they didn't take it. Very good. It's a bummer that I had to break the siege for that, but that probably yeah, I was gonna say that definitely means that they're gonna be willing to peace out now. So let's get Liege out of this war. Oh, just kidding. These guys do one out, though. Go. After we take his province up here, he'll be willing to peace out. And now the Platinate is the uh, HRE Emperor. Interesting. I'm curious what happened to Austria. I wonder why. Ah, uh, Maria. Yes. Of course. So, hypothetically speaking... I do want that. Maybe I do just have him. It's a lot of Diplo. Never mind, man. Berg, Aachen, Switzerland. So Switzerland, I definitely don't want in there. Aachen, I don't care nearly as much about. And Berg, I also don't really care a whole lot about. But let's just improve with them just to make sure they don't join. We just speed five this one for a bit. Reformation branches out. We now have a reform center over here in Nuremberg. We could convert if we wanted to. Always makes things a little interesting. Do we want to? We could. We very well could. Let's see here. Let's go with Brittany and Liege. Uh, Brittany and who else? Provence. Yeah, I think Provence would be a good one. Be able to get these two ideas. Push through that discipline. That's going to be really good. 15% goods produced is also very strong. Let's get these guys up there, by the way. There we go. We're in the money, baby. So I'm not really sure. I don't think we're gonna get a whole lot more out of this. We also just had our monthly t or our yearly tick, so this is probably good. We're gonna lose more Diplo. I've come to expect it at this point. We'll get the as close to 100% as we can again. Release Gascony. Very good. I think we'll actually. So these guys need to be improved again. So we're just going to speed five it for a bit and uh, just make sure everybody is uh, sorted out. So let's annex these guys. 24. It's fine. So do we want to go... Do we want to flip religions? I kind of want to. Is there anything in our mission tree that, you know, doesn't allow it? Nice. So once we get him, we'll actually get a lot of really good stuff. Oh, wow. A lot of people joined him. That's crazy, dude. That's actually crazy. So Gascony's pretty pissy. He's got 31 troops. I don't want to integrate him anytime soon. All right.
Yikes, man. So the Netherlands actually, it's like we're basically two nations. The Netherlands is almost as strong as we are when you really think about it, which is kind of crazy. He's like super loyal as well. Trust me implicitly. So I could do this and I will. Actually do it twice. Improve with them. That money is way better off in my pocket. Do we want this production? I think we do. And uh, the rest shall go into some heavies. We're going to end up needing some heavies, so let's do that. And then some lights for some trade. Monopolies are good. Do we want him to have like a big beefy army? I think we do. Seems like... And what are his military ideas? So he's got espionage. <laughs> he took espionage first. I'm over it, man. I'm over the AI taking espionage first. Uh, sailors, naval force limit, uh, yearly inflation, merchants, development costs. So eh, admittedly not the best. Not the best military, at least. I'm going to take this Mila group. This, is, uh, this one is not super helpful. Castilian Conquest, uh, Ottomans are going to join in, apparently. Are they going to join? No, they're preoccupied. Right, okay. So. Who do we have truces with? Do I have a truce with England? We have no CB on him. So we could do this, which would actually allow these guys to touch up their lands. It would be nice to be able to touch these lands up, so let's do that. Let's get this guy down here in the mountains. I don't imagine that they're going to have that many men. Yeah, they have like no men. They're going to carpet siege some stuff, but our forts actually do uh, project a solid zone of control. Brabantian noble rebels. Are they the Dutch or not? They have Dutch traditions. I wanted this, but now we're going to we're going to focus on mill now. Are oh, they going to take that? What is the siege ability? What are you talking about, man? They must have like offensive, innovative offensive or something. Do they? Religious offensive. Yeah, I don't know, man. That's pretty nuts, though. Let's wipe him out. Let these guys reinforce me. Stack wipe them there. Pretty good. Apparently not. Okay, man. I got nothing for that one. So this one shall go to right. Am I correct in saying it was Anjou? No. He's got two more cores that we'll be able to give him. Three if I decide to turn on them. So I might end up marching him. We'll see. He's got a claim on this. So they both just have a claim on it. So I might as well give it to Orléans. We can probably do that. Especially if we just let the let the ward let it tick up for a bit. Right. This annexation is hurting us quite a bit. So our general died. So that's... Oh my gosh, did I really just roll a 103? Contemplating uninstalling now. No, he's not a 103. The 113. Almost as useless, but not quite. go this is grasslands that's very good 
So let's separate piece out Lorraine. Trade power will be very useful. Help us make a little bit more money. Put you guys over there. And now we just sit and wait because we're not going to peace out until we don't get a coalition. So Switzerland is going to need a little bit more love. We're just going to sit back and wait. That's all. That's all we got to do. So we got a lot more um, supply limit. 45 is really good. So let's do that. Let's get uh, a few more men over here. Very good. This is fine. When is our truce with France up? Not for a long time. Truce with England soon. So let's see here. Does he have a claim? Does anybody have a claim on that? No claim on Alençon. Sadly. Let's say I really want that province there. Our diplomat is dead, sadly. Go. Absolute bummer. Let's take the Diplo guy. We uh, really don't need to be focusing on Diplo. I think we should probably be focusing Admin. Or Mill. My air is for... Oh, man. What do we focus? Let's see here. I definitely forgot to uh, turn the timer off, too. So you get a long episode today. Hope you hope you boys are all right with that. Let's focus mill, even it out. And uh, we'll sort this out in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, show your support. Leave a like and subscribe. And don't forget to ding the bell whenever you subscribe and get notifications. And then if you want to support us, there's a few ways linked below. Click the join button and support the channel via a membership. And uh, we also have a Discord. So if you want to check out the community Discord and chat with us over there, I'm active over there. And uh, it's a great way to get a hold of other people that like to play EU4. So that's all I got for you, though. This is Chewy Shoot. I hope you guys are cool with the long episode. And I'll catch you guys later. Huge special thanks to Palmer, Bloodbound, Drunk Binary, Some Kind of Meme, Valentel, Corbett, RJ Pilot, The Bitter Steel, Keith, Jonathan T.A.P., Salik, Mark Mensch, Devin Terhanika, Kenneth Wynn, Agent Rhino, Blonde Damon, Nathan Albright, William Reed, Airborne Animal 7, and many more. I appreciate you guys very much. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll catch you guys later.